Hello everyone and welcome to this week's video. This week I will be doing an abstract painting of a previous design I've made. This video was mostly made because I really wanted to cover up the design that you see right now on this board. Uh, I've already tried to cover it up with a few layers of white paint. That blue used to be black. But obviously that's not working. And even in the InDesign, this little checkerboard pattern still peeks through. But to quote our Lord and Savior, there are no mistakes, just happy accidents. So this abstract painting is based off of this sketch, which I then turned into this design, which is of a monochromatic drawing of a tiger in shades of green. The original inspiration for this piece was the energy of the heart chakra, the center chakra that houses our love, empathy, compassion, and forgiveness. I feel like I resonate with the heart chakra the most out of the chakras. I am a very empathetic person and I'm also not much of a grudge holder. I also believe in unconditional love when it comes from a place of self-love. I think I originally chose to draw a tiger because it's one of my favorite animals. But after researching, I learned that the tiger can be associated with courage, enthusiasm, and self-confidence. Which is kind of funny because I feel I lack some of these things. I'm very introverted, uh, not very outspoken, and sometimes I'm very self-conscious. I just think it's amazing like, what a wonderful self-discovery tool art is. Like, why aren't more people doing this? I mean, if your mind is open to new and unwanted information, you can learn so much about yourself. My choice of the tiger as the subject wasn't a deep choice at the time, but now looking back I can see the correlation between my feelings toward the heart chakra and the color green affected my choice to represent this familiar energy with an animal that represents the parts of the energy that I lack. So what I'm saying is that maybe if something interests you, there's a reason why and maybe it can help you learn about yourself and make your life better. Anyways, that's all the thoughts I had for this one, which was a lot of them, I know, but I'm trying to be a little more outspoken and maybe a little less gatekeeper-y about the things that interest me. Also, do y'all think I should do a series? I mean, maybe not of the abstract paintings, but of the, you know, chakras as animals idea in general. I know it's been done before, but I've already not followed the traditional, like, ones by making the tiger the heart chakra, so it would be my own interpretation of what animals I represent with each chakra and why. So yeah, uh, I guess I'll have some music for the rest of this video, and I hope you really enjoyed the process.
I hope y'all enjoyed this process. I really let myself be loose with this and not care as much about proportions and perfectness and focus more on textures and just the paint in general and didn't let myself get upset that it wasn't turning out good because it doesn't matter. Thank you so much for watching and a big shout out to my Patreons, uh, Jake, Chelsea, and Peyton. I really appreciate you guys. If you want to be a Patreon, um, I don't think it's linked down below. Actually, maybe I'll link it in a comment. I haven't learned how to link yet. You know, I'm, I'm new at this anyways. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.